Hello everyone and welcome to the latest episode of Funko Pop Love. I'm your host, Constance Miller. There haven't been really many pops that I've been wanting to collect as of late, and that's kind of freaky if you ask me since I'm so obsessed with them. But for this episode, I got a special pop, and then I had to get another one just to make it a little bit more lengthy. And it's also one that I don't have, so let's start with this one. The Scarlet Witch from Doctor Strange and the Multiverse of Madness. Now, I know many of you are sitting there going, oh my god, she was ruined in that movie. Well, be it as it may, she still had some awesome moments. And I think she's the second most character of Pops that I have. I might have to. She rivals Jean Grey's Flash Phoenix, for sure. So, let's go ahead and open her up and we'll take a look. This is obviously a bobblehead, and she's a Walmart exclusive. Even though I've never seen her at Walmart, I got her on Amazon at a really good price. So I'm pretty excited to have this, as I've got quite a few Wanda Maximoffs in my collection. So she's got this translucent kind of base, which I think is wonderful. Um, she's very pliable, so... I wouldn't want the heat to affect her standability. So, yeah. I think the coloring on her is amazing. The only thing they didn't do was give her, like, the black fingertips. Um, and I can't remember if that was a really big thing in the movie or not. I've only seen it a couple times. I could look into it, but it doesn't matter. I still have her. So this is the really big one that I wanted to showcase because it's a Funko Pop of me. Yes, I went ahead and made a Funko Pop of myself and I'm going to keep me in the box. <laughs> and But I'm going to take, uh, take me out to give a look. So here we go. All right, here I am as a Funko Pop. And I've got a cute little black dress on. I've got my red glasses and I'm holding some sushi. And the interesting thing about this pop is, aside from turnable head, I'm not a bobblehead, um, the arms have articulation, which is something that is never, or at least in any of the pops that I own, which is a lot, that's never been a thing. Also, the sushi roll is uh, kind of maneuverable, so I could have it like this, but I'm keeping me in the box because it has my name on it. And yeah, so there I am from the back. The only thing I don't like is the sandals. There wasn't a customizable shoe option. So I wanted the little cute black dress with the pearls and I had to sacrifice wearing sandals, which I don't wear. <laughs> but other than that, it's gorgeous and well worth the price paid. Now let's take a look at how many pops I actually own. So that is going to do it for this episode of Funko Pop Love. Don't forget to hit like and subscribe. Also hit that notification bell when you want to be notified whenever Renson Productions uploads a video. Also, if you are inclined to help the channel grow, you can do so by following the links in the description. 
I appreciate every single view, every single like, every single share, and the contribution to help the channel grow so very much. With all that being said, love and light to you all.